In this video, we will show you how to add a reusable product item or stock an easy invoice. Create a product once and use it for as many invoices as you like. First, go to the Setup section and select the Products tab. Tap the plus at the top to add a product. Add a name for your product. Then, you can also edit the product description below. Otherwise, the product description automatically displays the product name. Then, enter the general sales tax rate for the product and, if applicable, your local sales tax rate. The rates you entered when you set up your business will appear automatically, but here you can change them if needed. Next, you can define your current stock quantity and value. When you add a product to your stock list, you'll be able to set its cost and its selling price for better stock tracking. This is also where you can set low stock alerts if the number of your products goes below a certain number of items. This section is not mandatory. So if you don't sell products with easy invoice, but sell services, you need to turn off stock management in the general settings of your business. Finally, you can customize your pricing levels. This allows the app to automatically discount the price of an item when a customer buys larger volumes of a product. You can add as many pricing levels as you like and choose the amount of the discount for each level. To add a pricing level, tap the plus icon and set the number of units when a discount should be triggered and then adjust the price for that level. For each product item, you can also add files. Tap Add File to attach a photo or a document to this product. Then, select the correct file from your device's library. Now that you've added all your product's details, tap Save. Your product will now appear on your products list, and you will be able to select your product from the drop-down menu when you create an estimate or an invoice. When you wish to retire a product from your stock without deleting from your list of products, so you can keep track of past invoices, simply swipe the active switch towards the left.